Our government's overreach is beyond alarming. They're attacking your speech, your freedom, and even your money. But there's a way to fight back. Bitcoin. With Bitcoin in your own wallet, you're breaking free from the grip of centralized tyranny. No more letting banks use your dollars to fund wars or corrupt regimes you do not support. Bitcoin is your shield against total control. In today's video, we're calling out the corruption. First up, Elon Musk's concern about Hillary Clinton's disturbing push to jail people for free speech. Yeah. And for more on Clinton corruption, check out my last video where a Haitian man exposed how she stole his country. Very powerful stuff there. Next, we'll cover the FBI showing up at people's homes over Facebook posts and how one citizen sent them packing. Finally, we're tackling a shocking statement from a government official who said Trump needs to be eliminated because he's the threat to democracy. But here's the truth. It's those in power who are destroying democracy with wars and corruption. And boosting Trump back in 2016. But I also think there are Americans who are uh, engaged in uh, this kind of propaganda. Uh, and whether they should be civilly or even in some cases criminally charged uh, is something that would be a better deterrence. You have to just shake your head. So this woman's idea of democracy is putting people in jail for free speech. Unbelievable. Up next, we got a man sending the FBI packet. Great video. Yeah. How are you? Here we are. I'm Agent O'Donnell with the FBI. Can you give your full name, please? I'm Agent O'Donnell with the FBI. Is that sufficient to identify as only one O'Donnell affiliated with the FBI? In New Hampshire, yes. Could you please state your full name, sir? Could you please stop recording? No. It's First Amendment right. Okay. What's your name, sir? Could you stop recording, please? Absolutely not. You can show me your name and identification, or I'm going to go back inside my house. Oh, this is going out right after you guys I walk know, away. So, that's why I'm not so you can show me your name or ID. You can walk away. <laughs> we just want to talk to you. <laughs> I'm not going to talk to people who claim to be federal agents unless they can show me identification. Okay, well, you see our badges. I, I need to see. Is your full name on that badge? No. I'd like to see something with your full <laughs> name or I'm not going to talk to you. I prefer you not to broadcast it. This good. will be going online as soon as you walk away. I want to talk to you about you guys coming here. Say you make a salary of, I don't know what, low 100K? You guys making six figures? Factor in 50% expenses, overhead, maybe 100% expenses. I'm talking about burning a couple hundred dollars an hour just here, let alone all the time you guys are spending to investigate something that you know is not against the law, right? Like, so you, you're familiar with... So then why would sure. you come? Because we wanted to make sure that there weren't any... Other no, you're threats. coming because you're, you're, you're part of a regime that does this kind of thing when you know laws aren't being broken. And that's an embarrassment, man. Didn't you guys read the Constitution? Do you not believe in America? Sir, like, how do you do your jobs you and go home? We appreciate it. <laughs> you're walking away. Because nothing we did is against the law. And you guys are fuckheads that try to act like bullies. And I hope you go home and are embarrassed. You can't even say your name on camera because you know that what you're doing is embarrassing. You know Americans that believe in the Constitution think you're laughable. And you go home and you think about what you did today. Go home and think about it, you cowards. Drive away. Drive away. You're not welcome. You should be embarrassed. Embarrassing. You guys are embarrassing. Before we get into the last little clip here, I just ask you to like, subscribe, comment. It really helps out the channel. Um, this last one here, it's very shocking. Like, what the hell is this guy thinking? These are the people that are in charge right now. Just, just disgusting. Thanks for watching. Play hard, trade smart. Check this out. Questionable at this point that that man cannot see public office again. He is not only unfit, he is destructive to our democracy, uh, and he has to be, uh, he has to be eliminated. Uh,